What is up YouTube? Hope you guys are amazing. <laughs> what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. What is up YouTube? <laughs> What is up guys? Uh, welcome back to you. What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing all amazing as always. And let me just hold the tripod rather. Makes more comfortable. Anyway. Hope you guys are amazing. As you could see by the thumbnail of this video, we picked up a brand new to the channel. Oh, real I'm gonna close this door on the side. Picked up our real trip of teeth right here. But before we get into the video, thank you to all of you guys that subscribe to the channel. Can you please uh, like the video and leave a comment, please, guys? and tell me where you guys are from so before we get into the video i don't think we ever made a b-roll or as you most call it a cinematic on the channel so before we get into it let's get I'm attempting to do a cinematic, but as you guys could see, uh, it's Yamaha Warrior 350 needs a bit of work. Actually, now in that cinematic, it's the first time I realized that the wheels actually shows Yamaha. I was so amazed. But anyway, we will be doing a full rebuild on it, as in a complete rebuild. Removing the engine the rear sprocket. For those of you that don't know, the Yamaha Warrior 350 is one of Yamaha's most iconic uh, trail quads, if I should put it that way. They are extremely strong, they very durable. You cannot, it, it's most people say it's impossible to destroy a Yamaha Warrior. And let me show you the quad and then I'll go through some things. Okay, so here we have the Yamaha Warrior. This over here is the starter clutch. It sits in here with the stator. Over here is your gear selector. Gear 1 is down and in the middle it's neutral in between one and two and then it's five up it has six gears this over here is your clutch it has a parking brake here on top as well this is your reverse and neutral light get your key switch on that side on the right and then on your right handle you have your front brakes with your accelerator and Get your headlights. To switch the headlights on is on your left handlebar. It is low beam and high beam. So that's nice. It did not come with a rear tail light. So we'll have to modify something. We'll either order a replacement part. The quad has extended 
rear mount for the rear wheels. That's why it's sitting so wide out. So that's a bonus. And it has nerve bars, but shorts the cables, ah, the ropes for the nerve bars. But you do get replacement parts. This is on the right hand side. This is where your clutch sits. And this is your rear brake. What else can I tell you guys? That's about it. In the next video, we will go further into depth with the Warrior. But yeah. Oh, and it has a aftermarket exhaust. I would not have minded starting the quad for you guys now, but if you can see in here, this rubber boot that holds the carburetor has a slight tear in it here at the bottom. So it makes it difficult for the warrior to idle. So hopefully in the next video we'll add that sorted, then we'll give you guys a start. Get the back in the E30, that content will probably be out in the week. Depending on the weather. If the weather's good, I'm gonna shoot a video outside. But for now, lately we've been getting bad weather and lots of rain. So if it's not out in this week, it will be the following week. Oh that be running! Oh Before I end the video. On the previous video, we done the fenders for this ATV and if you haven't checked it out, go down in the videos and go check that video out and give it a like guys. But as I said to you guys, I will keep you guys updated as to the buying and the selling of the ATVs but I forgot to update you guys on the black ATV. Uh, I'll put a picture up over the here now. But that ATV was sold last week. Yeah, a buyer just came randomly during the week and just gave the money. Said I must keep it here for a day. Following day, he came with his bucket and he just collected it. So, at the moment, because he's waiting on a buyer for this one, posted it yesterday. And got a few replies already on it, but... Love you guys and I will see you guys on another one.